success guy is a very, very lonely road, man. Very few people are willing to endure the pain, the sacrifice, the diligence to be successful. It's an uphill battle. And along that road, you're not going to see too many friends. You're going to see your shadow most often. You got trust in the heart of hearts, inside what you're doing, what you believe in, is a worthy cause, a winnable fight. See, the thing is, for many people, they've tried the same path you're on, and they failed. As you walk this journey, you're going to see carcasses all over the place of people that didn't quite have it. That should inspire you, but you got further than that person, than that person. But you're not looking to get further than them, you're looking to finish. How do you know you're on the right path? Where do you go to ensure that? Success, many will love you for it. The majority will hate you. Because your success makes them feel insufficient in their current endeavor. Reminds them of where they could have done it when they came up short and how they didn't revisit it. Where they went at it and failed. And failure is what stood and never revisited it again. The difference between a winner and a loser Failure's there every single time. It's just the winner gets back up and does it again. It does it again until it goes his way. So now you're down that path and you're all alone. How do you know you're on the right path? How do you know what you're doing is in the right direction? It's not the title that makes you. It's not the success that makes you. The character defines the success, defines the theme, and it starts right there. Championships aren't won in the theater or the arena. They're one in the thousands of hours in the training room, in the labs, in the 5 a.m. runs, and when it's raining, when everyone else is sleeping. That's when it's won. The heart of a champion is a light switch that's always on. It doesn't go on and off when someone's watching. It's constant. It's how you look at something. If your name's attached to it, that you do it right. The best of your ability every single time. in the dark, was born in the dark, shaped by the dark, molded by the dark. Some of you were soft, but you were born in the dark, and now you're soft. Every time you come up to a challenge, you quit, you surrender, you give up, you give in. Every single thing I go through, I remember I was homeless, and I draw from it. Every single time I'm going through pain, I remember that I've gone through pain since I was a kid. I draw from it. Recycle your pain. And the last bit is... They didn't call my name. Told me it was over. But I've been deaf since I was three. So I didn't listen. Get something from it. You already in pain. Use it. Do something with it. Allow it to take you to the next level. Allow your pain to push you to greatness. Some of you, your success has messed you up. You so successful now, you saw. Your success has not benefited you. You've not grown as a result of being successful. You've lost your bite. You're not hungry anymore. Your success is damaging you. Are you hearing me? Some of you have been knocked out by life. And you got up and saw the blood. And you, uh, he hit. Sometimes in life, you have to hit back. It's not always going to be easy. They're not going to give it to you. They're not going to give you success. They're not going to put it on the platter. But if you're willing to work for it, if you're willing to put the sweat, the blood, the tears, if you're willing to earn it, they don't give away business. They're never on sale. 